just a few things uh we got chris chris sean rock and we also have something about 50 cent coming up so y'all make sure y'all listen up on that part so i'm gonna play a clip from chris sean uh chris sean rock that was the fuck is that am i saying her fucking name right it's chris sean right or is it chris sean I thought it was crayon, nigga. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, man. <laughs> motherfucker act like she bright uh, crayon. I, I, I can't. <laughs> All right, so so let me explain what's going on. So uh, I'm going to call her Creshawn. That's what I thought it, it is. Creshawn. I'm sticking fucking with it. So Creshawn Rock uh, was seen in Walmart walking with a dog and leaving her baby just hanging what's those things they put on front of them so the baby can sleep in front of them and shit and you don't have to hold them you just walk around baby legs be dangling and the, shit. Uh, little straps about, uh, talking about um Damn. Never mind, but y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, strap it to you. Yeah, yeah. To you. yeah, so I'm going to just call her the strapper baby. So she got the strapper baby on. And the baby legs was dangling like it's supposed to. But his head was leaned all the way the fuck back. Like he was doing a Matrix move or some shit. And at this age, this baby is probably, what, a month old? If that and you got this child out there just dangling and you walking a dog in Walmart all it would have took for you is to fucking trip over something that's all the fuck it would have took and, 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 and this baby probably would not be here today you know so um I'm going to play to you, and uh, I don't know how well you're going to hear it on your end, uh, Terry, but they're going to hear it crystal clear on their end, But, and I'll uh, unmute you when it's done. I'm about to play a clip on her replying to the person who was recording her with her baby, laid lopsided, Matrix move style, Walking a goddamn pit bull in Walmart, and I think some fucking flip flops or some shit. I'm not. I'm not sure, but uh, Morris. I'll uh, take her baby. Yeah, we'll get to that. Let's let's see what she had to say. Uh, Terry, I'm gonna meet you real quick. Uh, we're gonna see what she had to say. So everyone, listen up. Forty me. She could have just helped me. I got a dog. Two carts are full of. Shit I need for my house. Um, I'm calling my baby daddy. Is he helping? No. So I don't know why he's chiming in either. Uh, this mommy shit is cool, but man, your mind is racing 36, eight hours a day. And then transitioning to beings. Everything in my situation, I don't know. Like everything is just overwhelming. Uh, I'm still learning. Um, I love my baby. He's a good baby. I'm gonna tighten up, straight up. What are you talking about? Big Rock got this. You hear me? Everybody make mistakes. Period. Now, now, Morris, I don't know how much of that you heard, but I'm gonna kind of go through it. Basically, she's saying the lady who was recording her could have helped her out she was walking around with a cart a baby and a dog and she she don't know why her baby daddy which is blue face she don't know why he had something to say about it because he didn't help her he's not helping her and she said um she was buying things for the house and, and, and all this type of stuff. 
And then she went on to say that she, you know, what she said, she loved her baby. <laughs> I love my baby. My baby's a good baby. <laughs> like, what's a bad baby? This baby's I like what? It's like a month old. It's, or if that, what? What is a bad baby at a month? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not understanding just, this. And 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 just, then she's gonna. I just want to push her down some stairs. Oh, stop it! And, and then she says, um, "And what, what's that other part she had mentioned?" She said, "Yeah, your mind is just racing." Thirty-six eight hours a mile or something. I don't know what the fuck. It, it it didn't even make sense how she said the damn thing. And she's like, but I got this. Believe that. Dude. This is is mind-boggling. Ho- hopefully, she's learning from this. Look, man. I can't even believe you even sit up here going down this route of her learning. Don't even go down this route. This is mm-hmm. a case of a woman going into stupidity with her eyes wide open. Period. She wants that ignorant shit. She, everybody knows this ain't how you're supposed to handle a baby, man. Nah, man. She, I ain't giving her no leeway on that. And she don't get no bail money from me. Hell nah. I heard Blueface getting on my nerves, man. <laughs> they need to quit promoting them niggas. Well, I mean, they, they, they just completely completely just it's not even it's to the point it's not even entertaining it, it's lost its entertainment value man y'all around here toxic beating each other up you know what i'm saying y'all around here showing you know sexual promiscuity out here out here showing drunk uh, getting drunk in public fighting people and toxicity all over man you know, he, he beating up your parents and in-laws or whatever, or your father or whatever they had a show. Didn't they have a show where he was beating up somebody, her, her brother or her father or somebody he smacked or punched up? Yeah, it, it looked like, but it looked like they was trying to start with him. But like, it's just the like point, you, that whole situation, I, that yeah, is I, just toxic, period. I, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not giving him any type of, uh, you know, pass or anything, but it's like, at the same time, if you if you look at it, I know you don't pay attention to it, but I did recall seeing it once or twice. And the yeah. whole time, you know, the brother was trying to start shit with him. Like, yeah. you can see the brother was on some shit. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Well, what I'm saying is just the whole toxicity of the whole show, the whole promotion of these niggas. Like, what are they doing? Blueface ain't coming out with no music. She ain't working on nothing. What, like... What are they doing, nigga? That's my whole thing. I think Blueface I knew what he was these, doing. Nigga. Blueface, I mean, of course, knew he was doing. Of course, he know. I'm saying, but it's like at the end of the day, it's lost its entertainment value to me. It's never really entertainment to me anyway. If I want to see them two dumb niggas, all I gotta do is go out my front door. Yeah, Blueface want his music career to to bump off a little higher, um, but. Let me tell you how I see it. It, it. It's a crazy circle because if you see the old pictures of uh, Creshawn uh, Rock, yeah, she was same. she was very very attractive. She was in yeah. nice shape. She looked like a, a a nice, cute, smart young lady. She was. You know, I I, I can't oh, say she was because I, I don't I, I I didn't see her. So yeah, that's what I'm talking about. She she looked like she was just watching the picture, look watching a video of her or whatever. It's like okay, she she looked like she's you know the, you know the the smart pretty girl out of the group. And, but looking at them go through what they go through, it almost seems like Blueface is sucked into the drama. I'm not giving him that leave, as he he's staying there for a reason. But I don't know. I I think he knew from the beginning. Yeah. It's like as long as yeah, this keeps know. getting views, as yeah, long as this keeps getting you. talked about, and I can make her look like the crazy one, I'm good. 
You know, I, I can't talk about him about how how a father he is because I don't know. I really don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? But he looked like the guy who who needs to get some money. I, I think he got money, but he needs to get that money, money. I'm talking about he need to be in the millions. He ain't there yet. And taking over the internet will get you there. I don't even see it. I don't even see who keep paying attention to these niggas. I, I don't pay attention well, too it's much. Mainly but... the, it's mainly the women. Nah. I feel like they, a lot of these women be living vicariously through through her her ignorance, in my opinion. Uh that's pretty dumb. I, I I just every time I hear them niggas and see them, I'm like, what the fuck, man? Are they like that's what I'm saying? These niggas ain't got no charity going. They ain't going to speak at no those no schools and they help kids out. Ain't opening up. They ain't doing nothing, man. Mm-hmm. And that's my thing. I'm like, I, I'm just like, fuck them, shit. I ain't in it, dude. Yeah. So, uh, how do you think this is gonna end? You think uh, child protective services is gonna reach out to Miss uh, Rock and say, no. hey, uh, give us that goddamn baby? Like, what do you hey. think? Is, is this? Is this? What do you feel for the baby? I feel like the baby's going to grow up in a toxic, embarrassing environment. And, and, and become like a Kodak Black or some shit? Man. I can see that. Be like a, a, a light-skinned Kodak Black. Like an Allen boy type of motherfucker. <laughs> I'm an Allen boy. I think they got videos. And they were... you, know, <laughs> you know they say high yellow motherfuckers and, and red bone motherfuckers is dangerous anyway. <laughs> Anybody who look mixed is dangerous, god damn it. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Mixed women, yellow women, I don't care what nobody <laughs> say, nigga. They nuttier than a fruitcake, nigga. Oh, man. Nuttier than that damn payday. <laughs> goddamn Hoosier bullshit. It's a goddamn Hoosier. Mm-hmm. That's what you are. 